brief you on the safety procedures of this aircraft. We ask that you remove your personal headphones until the end of the briefing. Portable electronic devices may be used during the flight as long as they're in flight safe mode. You may use handheld devices such as mobile phones, tablets and e-readers during takeoff and landing. You may also use personal headphones at these times. Larger items including laptops must now be switched off and stowed away yeah, safely. As a reminder, smoking is not permitted at any time whilst on board. On our flight today, we have a customer traveling, traveling with us who has a severe nut or peanut allergy. May we request that you refrain from eating any peanuts or nuts or snacks that may you may have brought on, the, on board with you. Thank you for your cooperation and understanding. A328 uh, operating the uh, 491 service from Gibraltar to London Heathrow. My name is Dale McCullen, the first officer on your flight today, and it is my pleasure to welcome you on board uh, this afternoon. Uh, first of all, I'm going to keep this short because we do need to get underway. Uh, uh, apologies for the late running of the service, and mainly due to uh, late arrival of this aircraft into Heathrow for our outbound leg, uh, along with some bits and pieces just now to get uh, more people on the aircraft due to our uh, council service on the right hand side there. Uh, joining me here on the flight deck is the captain and commander of the aircraft, Captain Aaron Maynard. Uh, looking at you there in the cabin, we have an excellent team of five with Craig in charge. Joining Craig, we have Helen, Erf, um, Hannah and Sean. Uh, once we do get underway, we're looking at a flight time today of around about 2 hours and 40 minutes. In a second, Craig and the team will give you a safety demonstration. Can I please ask you to give them your full attention? And also in the cruise, if the seatbelt signs come back on, can I ask you to return to your seats, pass your seatbelt and keep it as well as I'll come back to you in the cruise with an update and uh, thank you once again for your patience and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks. Thank you very much, Captain Crew. That's door to automatic and cross check, please. and location and operation of the doors. In the event of an emergency, low-level lighting will guide you to an exit. All exits are clearly marked to be pointed out to you now. Please take a moment to locate your nearest exit, bearing in mind this may be behind you. Open the doors automatically and inflate the evacuation slide. High-heeled shoes must be taken off as this may tear the slide. Please ensure your seatbelt is fastened. It must be worn whenever the signs are on and it's fastened and adjusted like this and opened like this. For your comfort and safety, we recommend you keep your seatbelt fastened and visible at all times. If the cabin air supply fails, oxygen will be provided. Oxygen like this will, be, will appear automatically. If you're wearing a face mask, this should be removed before, before putting on an oxygen mask. Stay in your seat and pull the oxygen mask towards you. Place the oxygen mask over your mouth and nose and breathe normally, adjusting the band to secure it. Please note that the bag may not inflate. You may need to pull on a colour streamer to release your mask. Please make sure your own mask is fitted before helping anybody else. Your life jacket is underneath or beside your seat. If required, remove the jacket from its container and pull it over your head. Pass the tapes around your waist and tie them securely into a double bow at the side. To inflate, pull the red toggle as shown. The air can be topped up by using this mouthpiece. There is a whist and a light for attracting attention. Do not inflate your life jacket until you are outside the aircraft. Any personal devices with flight safe mode should have this feature enabled now. Handheld devices must be held securely or placed into a pocket. Larger devices, including laptops, must now be switched off and stowed in your luggage for takeoff and landing. Please, please take care your device does not get lost within your seat. If it does, please don't move it, but let one of your cabin crew know. Devices must be switched off and disconnected from the seat power socket when not being used in flight. Please ensure your hand baggage does not block the aisle or exit. It must be put under the seat in front of you or in an overhead locker. Place items in the locker carefully as this may fall out and injure someone. 
In case of an evacuation, you must move quickly to the closest usable exit, taking nothing with you. Please ensure now that your seat is upright and in the takeoff position with the armrest down and your table folded away. Window blinds must now be open in preparation for takeoff.
service will then be followed by a Highline Cafe service. Pre-purchase items will be served first, followed by onboard purchases. If you'd like to purchase from a selection of Highline Cafe items on today's flight, please connect to the Wi-Fi to discover what items are still available or refer to the menu card in your seat pocket. As part of our BA Better World initiative, you can now purchase a contribution to carbon offsets for £2.50 or donate to our charity partnership of Line Start. We invite you now to make yourself a home and enjoy our hospitality. If there's anything that my team and I can do to make your journey more comfortable, please let us know. Thank you.
proceeded with your seatbelt securely fastened until the fastened seatbelt signs have been switched off. When it is safe to do so, please take care when opening the upper lockers as items may have moved and could fall out and cause injury. You may now make and receive calls as well as use all data services on your handheld electronic devices. Please check that you have all your personal belongings with you before leaving the aircraft. If your journey ends here at Heathrow, please follow the yellow signs for arrivals. And if you are connecting onto another flight from Heathrow today, please check the information screens for your departing gate number. If it is not your display, please follow the purple signs for flight connections. If you require any assistance at Heathrow, please do speak to our ground colleagues. We'll be happy to help. And for those customers who have ordered special assistance to leave the aircraft today, please remain seated until the aisle around is clear and a member of crew is able to assist you. On behalf of all of us on board and British Airways, I'd like to thank you for choosing to fly with us today and we look forward to seeing you again.